High traders S&P 500 ended with a slight drop of 0.2% but the Nasdaq gained 1.7% which was all about Apple. Good Apple quarterly reports together with the news of increase in Apple shares by Warren Buffett led to a jump of 13% in the share price and helped the Nasdaq index to gain or to finish in green territory. In the coming week Wall Street will have to deal again with the China trade agreement and with the lower than expected employment figures which were published on Friday. That raises inflation concerns again. Let's have a technical view of the market. When we look at the S&P 500 we can see consolidation the market is just going sideways however take a good look at the support line of the 200 moving average that's a simple moving average which supports the market and the resistance line which is around the 2700 and that's the 50 moving average so we're moving in between those lines we're playing ping pong between those lines and we will make finally a decision soon but again we have no idea which direction since the market finished up on Friday therefore it is more likely for the market to continue higher this week but again it's very very hard to say let's take a look at my last week picks my first pick last week was uh, Nike long Nike did not trigger so therefore we will wait for Nike to trigger hopefully sometime soon my second pick last week was Yum Yum failed it did trigger however came down with bad earning reports uh, I usually don't lose more than 3% in this case since it's gap down I lost 4% so Yum is out of the game let's have two picks for this week My first pick for the week is COP long over $67.30 a very nice technical formation for a breakout over the highs nice trend uh, ConcoPhillips uh, is a producer of uh, natural gas and oil and uh, again if the market is going to continue higher then uh, we have a very good chance with uh, COP long. My second pick for the week is Cisco long over $46.16. Uh, Cisco has a very nice consolidation area at the top it's a networking and com communications producer and if it's going to move over the highs especially if the market is going to help uh, we may have a very nice breakout in Cisco. I wish you a great trading week and I'll see you next week. Thank you for watching this video. Before you go, we invite you to take Traders Free Trading Challenge. If you succeed, you will receive free trading education and access to a $14,000 funded trading account that will allow you to trade from home and keep 70% of your profits. Click here to sign up for this no risk, no cost offer. If you like this video, please subscribe to our YouTube channel where you can view many more stock trading videos. Questions or comments, please submit them below.